Okay, so since my uh, pre-tune circuitry is working fine, the next step as logical would be to look at the output of the VCO and see if it follows the pre-tune when the loop is not closed. Actually, right now there is no error, so it's closed. And this guy has two outputs, and that's the sum loop VCO. So if I take this one, let's see if I can do that with one hand. Ah, no, the loop is sure broken. So that's that's the one that was going into the frequency detector, and I made a little cable here so I could look at the output of the VCO, which is now free running, All right, because it's. I have just broken the loop. It says output 120 to 220 megahertz. I mean, everything is written on this machine. This is just great. So I have put myself over here and I printed this table as a table I had before. So when I was checking the voltage of the pre tune, now I can check the sum loop free running VCO. So when I am at 320 indicated, which is what it is here, I should be at 120 megahertz. And unfortunately I repaired this thing. Uh, center 120, span 20 megahertz. See what we have here. Oh! What's up? So nothing good. Let's see. Let's do a big oh here it is. Ooh, I see. Well, it's way out of tune. Okay. No. Maybe so there it is. Let's put a little bit of attenuation here. This is a strong signal. There we go. And so I am tuning, but I'm way out. That would explain it. So let's see how far out am I? Um, okay. So let's do a. Uh, Peak search and frequency count. I am at. I don't know if you can see it. This this thing is an amazing instrument. It has a frequency counter in it. So it's 104.06 megahertz, and I should be at 120. Uh oh. So that would explain it. Let's see what happens at the other end. Um, so go back to 329 over here so that would be the end of the, the other end of the pre-tune and I should be at 219 so let's try that center frequency 219 megahertz and it's the same thing I'm way out uh, peak search and frequency count I'm 240 so I have 15 megahertz out uh, but the same uh, so I'm, I'm about 10 megahertz off so the VCO is not set up properly and my guess is that it's, it's why it's not working, it's not in the capture range or at the border of it. So I need to change that and uh, hopefully it's just an adjustment.